And hello and welcome back to Let's Play Metroid Prime 1. Uh, still, I know where we are, I'm just, it's... Anybody that's been paying attention knows that's been a few months for me, so I apologize. It's been about four months, but uh, yeah, we have gotten our... And it's still dark. Not too surprising. We've gotten our... Heat visor? Is that the proper... You know, there's a really easy way to find out what it's actually called. No, that's not the way. There we go. Let's find out what it's actually called. Thermal visor. So it's kind of close. Um, I think we should be moving on to a boss now, so hopefully... Since it's been a few months, I don't fully remember where we were going. But we should be able to get back on track here before too long, I'd reckon. So... Oh, we've gone the wrong way now, haven't we? No, wait, let's see. Because I think we were supposed to go back down. And the way we are going is absolutely the wrong way. So, okay. Well. <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> Sorry. Apologize for that. I was not expecting that. But yeah, we should be good to go now. Because obviously that was um very much so the not right way. It's been a while, so I apologize for it. Hmm. Okay. Well, at least we should know where to go now. Seismic analysis complete. And we need to go that direction, which, now that we have the thermal visor, I believe we can. So, okay. Which, I knew that was where we needed to go. I just needed to remember how to get over there. Is the... Oh, missed the jump. Come on, just go down. I thought I changed. There we go. Yeah, may not have before, but I did now. All right. Let's get now. And I was going to say, we should be able to... We should be able to do that jump quite easily, but something just keeps bumping Samus's head. So, can't really blame her for that. But yeah, we are now on our way to where we need to go. Uh, have we gotten you yet? I have, okay. I don't remember... Yeah, I was gonna say, these guys should be... There we go. So they're not too bad. It's just been a while since I've played, so having to get used to everything again, so I apologize for that, just... I know that I've said it should be... Oh, no, not quite. Okay. I am still going the right way, yeah? Yes. Yes, I am. Okay. Sorry, I just have to double check a few times, because otherwise I am going to make a mistake. And it's... Okay, so we just need to go down now. I apologize. Yeah, just trying to come back to this, and it's been... About four months since I last recorded. I've just been busy, unfortunately. Having a baby will do that, you know, so. Been having to, uh, get used to not having time to record and trying to. Our last couple months have been quite busy as well, so I've been trying to find time for that. My wife doesn't mean to, obviously, let me not record, but that's what happens. Um, I don't think any more Montreux pop out. Of course, I say that, and. The exact opposite is going to happen, but should be okay. I guess we'll see. But yeah, nothing too much really exciting has been going on. Um, if you're actually really interested, I was gonna say, um, feel free to uh, watch the Aria of Sorrow here. It was just because I do feel like going over the same thing twice would be kind of silly, honestly. But I have gotten a new job, so that's been part of it, and just been getting used to the hours. I've been enjoying that job quite a bit, so I'm quite glad for it. What I'm not so glad for are that these guys are not dropping any health at all. And now I'm stuck in a corner. Like, it's been a while since you guys dropped any health. I would like a little bit. Oh. 
should be good to go now, though. And I don't think there should be any more... Mutroids. Right. There we go. <coughs> Not too much more now. No, we should... I don't remember the game happening to really do this dark of an area again after this. I might be misremembering, but... I don't seem to think that I am. Of course, I did say after this, and we still have to get out, so... I do still have a little bit more to go, and then... This next boss isn't too hard, if I remember correctly. It has been a little bit of time since I've done this boss, though, so I guess we'll see. I guess I should probably turn this back on for you guys, because I don't know... Like, I can shoot you guys outside of it, but I don't know if it's being as effective or not, so... Well, I do like not being able to... not having to use it. Being able to actually get you guys does happen to be quite nice. <coughs> ah, I apologize. My family has been a sick... Has been a sick... Uh, <laughs> My family's been sick for the last couple of days, so we're all still partially getting over it, at the very least, a little bit. So, just something we've been having to deal with. It's not too bad my son got a ear infection and a cold at the same time, and then he passed that on to his mother, and his mother passed that on to me. So, we've all just been having a great sick time. Would have been nice to not not gone sick, but yeah, whatever. I don't remember what was over here. Must have been a power up. Not there anymore, though. But yeah. Aside from that, I can't really remember much else that has happened. Uh, I talked about this a little bit, but I don't mind. Uh, my son has started walking. He's gotten pretty decent at it. He's still not 100% up to snuff, which I can't blame him for, but he is getting there. Practice makes perfect, after all, so he'll get there eventually. Why am I shooting this one? I'm about to go to a save point and get health. There you go. Yeah. But yeah, he's also gone backwards walking a little bit down now, too, which is fairly impressive, actually. He's gotten a lot more interactive and a lot more fun, which I definitely happen to enjoy. Like, I loved my son before, and I still do love him, of course. There isn't anything he could do that would make me love him less. There are stuff that he could do that would make me disappointed in him, but that doesn't mean I'd love him less. Should be activating. But it's not. Maybe I'm missing something. It's a door. Oh. Behind the statue. I'm just trying to remember now, because it's like up behind the statue. Okay. It's been a little bit of time. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I am silly. It's alright. I still have to remember that we actually have uh, super missiles. It's something that I'm still getting used to, so. Right. Okay. Just. There you go. Eventually I'll get used to it, and it's like. Because super missiles, I know that we got, and it's just. haven't used them really too much yet, as far as I'm aware, so. But, I was going to say, we should be moving on to the boss now. He's really not too hard, if I'm remembering correctly. 
Uh, you do need the thermal visor, though, because... reasons. Okay. I dodged both of those. Was not quite expecting that, to be actually honest. There's a big pile of rocks there. I wonder if it could... Oh, there's a cutscene as we approach the pile of rocks. Wonder what those could be. have some of the best music. I'm not going to be singing along though because uh, I'm listening through my computer to the music or to the sound of the game so it's like a couple seconds late. So, okay, Thardius and Emma. Yep, I wonder if we happen to have that visor for locking on. How'd I get overloaded? Oh. Hey, he can use the morph ball. Yep. That's about all there is to say about that. We get a... You might be able to tell which uh, upgrade we get from him, so... You know. There goes one part. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Nothing to do. Gotta follow this joke. It's gotta stop now. broken yet? Nope, not yet. Alright. See, I prefer the power beam for this game, because the, the beams actually... Ow. I trying to get out of the way of that. Do make a difference for this game. I don't know if they really do for most of the other games, but they definitely do for here, so... He is... not liking me today, which... It's all right. It's been a while since I fought this boss, anyways. So, you know that might be a good reason why now I can happen to do that without. We can be able to fire on him now without having. There we go. All right. I'm sure this can work too. I'd be surprised, honestly. Oh. Can we get up there? I doubt it. I'd be surprised. Yeah. Okay. Break, break, break. Alright. But yeah, he's really not too bad. You can shoot those rocks for health and ammo, which is admittedly something I was forgetting to do. So. I'm not suspecting that he'll kill us, but we'll see. There we go. There goes another part of him. He is looking a little bit, uh... What's the word? Not as good. I'm sure people have done this game uh, perfectly before, but that is not... Ah, I tried to get out of the way did not do so well though. But that's not something I, I'm not really much of a perfect run type of guy. Maybe for RP, certain RPGs, the main one I can think of is the uh, Mega Man Battle Network series. Because it's like, the Robot Masters you can have, or not the, the Navius, part of me, can happen to make it so it's not per okay. particularly hard to do that because you can kind of cheat the system a little bit for that game, so it's a little bit easier. And by cheat the system, I mean that you can, um, 
I'd really like if you'd stop doing that every six seconds, Stardust, especially since it is... Oh gosh, okay. Forgot about that. There we go. Uh, you can have specific things that you go for. Like, you can have... Uh, after the first game, you can have specific chips that you have reserved. So, it makes it... I think it makes it a significant amount easier. So... What? Missed? Really? Okay. Not that time, though. And Thardis is at half health now, so... Although... Come on, Thardis. Don't be like that, buddy. I only need your spider ball form. If you just give it to me, I'd let you be. To be fair, he did attack us first, but it doesn't make me feel any more right about doing this to him, honestly. Okay, got that at least. We are at half health, and he's slightly uh, below half health, I believe. I think we're slightly above half health ourselves. If you could stop moving Thardis so I could actually hit you, that would be fantastic. No, let me hit you. Like, this is... Ah, ow. One of the problems with Thardis... It, at least I have a problem with this part. It gets significantly harder to hit his stuff up... His parts up top. It's still doable, but it's not as fun, I'd say. Doing your lightning attack? Uh, maybe? Yeah, there we go, okay. Just took him a second. Or would that be thunder? Yeah. This should be easier to hit this time, I suspect. Considering it's his chest. Of course, if he goes into that again, then it's not so easy. I think you can happen to hit him right now, it's just a little hard. It's obviously easier with the lock-on, so... Which, you know, makes sense. Locking on makes it so you don't have to worry so much about... I think I have actually have hit him once or twice. Okay, so now we're under half health, but he should be going down here as soon as we actually get a good shot on him. We'll try the, the wave beam. That might help. Oh! Okay. The wave beam does happen to go faster, and since we are out of super missiles now, we may as well, honestly. Like, I do really happen... Ow. Where'd you go? You're behind me, aren't you? Yep. The wave beam, I think, does happen to... Like, since the wave beam does go so much faster, that does happen to be a very big help. I'll just keep pelting him at the moment. I'm gonna get you, Thardis. I'm gonna hopefully get you while you're inside of there, too, so... Nope. Okay. It's alright. He's not too hard, just... Wow! That fight did take a bit of time, though. I didn't realize we were at 20 minutes, so I think as soon as we uh, get our spider ball, that's where we'll end it, and then we'll continue next time. I did not realize it had been that long. So I saw we went into it with 10 minutes, I didn't realize the fight itself had been 10 minutes, so... Alright, that's fine. Uh, yeah. And then Power Beam, as I said, just... I do prefer the power beam, but it's just, it is a lot slower. Uh, scan log. I don't know if you actually have to scan it or not, but yeah, we'll get the spider ball, and then we'll continue on next time. And with that, we can now climb up walls. I don't think this was in a Metroid game 
since Metroid 2, if I'm remembering correctly. So it had been many years since the spider ball had actually come back. So it was nice. And then they brought it back in, obviously, Metroid Samus Returns. But that we can talk about next time because we are done with this episode. So thank you very much for joining me. You make sure you all have a great day. However, as we always do, before the end of the episode, let us give prayer and glory to God. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of death. Amen. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly, we humbly pray. And to you, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, cast into hell, Satan, and all evil spirits who wander through the world for the ruin of souls. Amen. Psalm number 98. O oh, sing to the Lord a new song, for he has done marvelous things. His right hand and his holy arm have gotten him victory. The Lord has made known his victory. He has revealed his vindication in the sight of the nations. He has remembered his steadfast love and faithfulness to the house of Israel. All the ends of the earth have seen the victory of our God. Make a joyful noise to the Lord, all the earth. Break forth in a joyous song and sing praises. Sing praises to the Lord with the lyre, with the lyre and the sound of melody. With trumpets and the sound of the horn, make a joyful noise before the King, the Lord. Let, let the sea roar and all who fill, and all that fills it, the world and those who dwell in it. Let the floods clap their hands, let the hills sing for joy together before the Lord, for he comes to judge the earth. He will judge the world with righteousness and the peoples with equity. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you very much for watching. You make sure you all have a wonderful day, and God bless.